It is a pleasure to share this with you. Take a look. It is a joyous moment outside Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center as 91 year old Dr. Jean McGuire is released from the hospital a week after she was stabbed in Franklin Park. WBZ's Courtney Cole is live in Boston. Courtney, she was all smiles and she was also so thankful to everyone who's helped her. Absolutely, and tonight, Ms. McGuire and her family, they are so thankful to the medical team here at Beth Israel. But they're also very grateful, they say, to the two people that found Ms. McGuire after she was attacked and made sure that she got help. I've never, in my 91 years, not felt safe walking the streets of Boston day or night, never. Now, Ms. Jean McGuire says she will never go back to the park again alone. It's in my head that it, it, it wouldn't be wise. It's a different time. Last Tuesday, McGuire, a civil rights leader and educational pioneer, as a former executive director of METCO, was stabbed several times while walking her dog in Franklin Park. I used the training I had, which I did with my staff, to protect myself if somebody attacks my body. That was my foot, my knee, and this almost ruined my arm. Tonight, police are looking for the suspect they believe was also hurt and may have tried to seek medical assistance. I mean, for a 91-year-old woman to actually go through this type of incident and truly survive is truly a blessing. Jean is a very, very strong woman. We look at her as our Wonder Woman. McGuire's nephews, Mark Williams and Ron Mitchell, a WBZ employee, say she's recovering well but she still has a long way to go. We want to ask our community to stand up for Jean. If you know anything, if you saw anything, even if you don't think it matters, please call the uh, Crime Stoppers line. When it comes to her assailant, McGuire just wants to know why. I always want to find out why you're so angry or why you want to hurt somebody else, you know. Now, selflessly, Ms. McGuire chose to make today about we and not me. So coming up in the next hour here on WBZ, I'll tell you what her nephew said you can do. You watching right now, if you want to help Ms. McGuire. Reporting live at Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center, I'm Courtney Cole for WBZ News. We all want to help. We'll see you at 6 o'clock. Courtney, thank you. Now